We've been talking today about the Lancashire Independent Economic Review. We're at a pretty crucial point. The interim uh, findings are out. The consultation uh, is pretty much closed now. And it's time to really start to digest what it all means for Lancashire, what it means for the businesses, for the uh, public sector, for the communities of Lancashire. And uh, what I've been doing today is listening to a group of really interesting Lancashire business people talking about some of the really nitty gritty issues we've got to get into around planning, communities, uh, uh, infrastructure, investment. Uh, a really good learning opportunity. So today's event was about the Independent Lancashire Economic Review, which is a piece of work that we've been doing at the County Council with uh, Mike Emerick at Metro Dynamics, uh, and they've been looking at the economy of Lancashire, how it's made up and how we can improve it going forward. It was really interesting when uh, he was talking about the need for greater transport um, infrastructure in Lancashire and where the population of the county currently is. So it's very much based on that east-west matrix as opposed to north and south. Whilst it's something that I kind of always knew, it was really interesting to see that kind of laid bare and help us think how we're going to improve transport in terms of road and rail and broadband uh, in the future. It was quite optimistic because he was talking about things that I wasn't necessarily aware of as a local, as a local business person at quite, quite a lower level, of things that are going on that might potentially happen in the future in our county. And that things that at, at, at a ground level people are concerned about, i.e. Um, uh, small cities competing in the county rather than us all working together. It's not just us that know that, the higher ups know that too. And it's good to know that they're working uh, towards changing that for the better. If you enjoyed that video, then please subscribe to our YouTube channel on the link below and be among the first to get to listen to all the latest interviews through the Downtown Den.